Hello YouTubers, this is the Nubifier. Because there's currently a sale on, I wanted to make a super short and super powerful video that could help you get the ship you want, even if you can't afford it right now. If you miss this sale, don't worry, there'll be another. Just remember what I'm talking about today and you can use it in the future. Today, most of the ships are on sale. That means that today we're able to buy or upgrade all those limited ships that we don't normally have access to. So what I'm gonna talk about today is the zero dollar upgrade. There are two times that you may wanna do this. The first example is if you own a Super Hornet but haven't decided if you want a Gladiator or not. You can buy a CCU or cross chassis upgrade for zero dollars just in case you change your mind in the future. It's a little bit of zero dollar peace of mind as the Gladiator and the Super Hornet are not normally on sale and the switch is zero dollars. You could technically buy a bunch of CCUs to a Gladiator and a bunch back to a Super Hornet. This would cost you no money and would technically give you two ships to play with an Arena Commander or the Baby PU. You can zero dollar CCU most ships providing that ship has another ship in the exact same price range. A Connie Taurus to a Gian Scout, 315P to a Reliant Skirmisher, 315P to a Mustang Delta. These are all examples of ships that are always on sale being the exact same price as a limited ship. Buy the upgrades and throw them into your account. Costs nothing and gives you options in the future. My next scenario is actually something I've been pondering. The Banu Merchantman is $250 and rarely on sale. The Redeemer is also $250 but is always on sale. As it's available right now, by buying a $0 CCU to a Banu Merchantman from a Redeemer will let you buy it whenever you want. All you need to do is buy a Redeemer which is always on sale and then use your upgrade token that you purchased today for $0 to upgrade it to a Banu Merchantman. For the final bit here, I want you guys to know that I'm aware that LTI won't be important in the game. However, if you had a choice of buying a ship with 6 month insurance or LTI for the same price, we all know what people would do. So let's take that last scenario one step further. If you were to upgrade an LTI P72 to a Redeemer and then apply your Banu Merchantman upgrade, you would have a fully functional Banu Merchantman LTI. In this instance, you can use any ship that's LTI below $250 and upgrade that to a Redeemer and then apply your upgrade. So just a quick recap, you can CCU back and forth between two ships that are not normally on sale, you can CCU to a limited ship when it's not on sale, and of course you can CCU to a limited ship with LTI when it's not on sale. Please like and subscribe if you like the style of my No Bullshit series. I feel this is really important information to get out to new backers, so please link this content to people you know who are just starting out. GG, and I'll see you in the verse.